Okay, I'm totally being a tourist right now. Um, all the other interns at the company who are not based out of Richmond have left. I'm the only one still here, but then again, I have a rental car. So why not be a tourist? We're at Libby Hill. At the uh, Confederate Soldiers and Sailors Monument. Uh, supposedly this is the view that uh, Richmond was named after. It's part of the uh, last year's collegiate road race and uh, this will be this year's World, world championship course. This is the Libby Hill uh, cobbles here, the uphill. Goes up and around a little bit. I think it. See, kind of goes like goes up a little bit. It's too bad. Too bad I don't have uh, enough time to really ride this. This was like I. It was something I really hoped to do. There just wasn't enough time. Hey, I, I do have my bike. I rode, uh, I rode on Thursday, but... I mean, I don't really have much time to ride. Because the rental car's due back in Philly at, like, 5. So... Here's downtown Richmond from Libby Hill. Uh, I can walk over a little bit here. The Lucky Strike smokestack. There's a GRTC bus down there. Very small uh, transit operation here in Richmond for a city of this size, but. There's the bridges over the James River. Richmond's like the fall line of that river. So, here's the rest of the park. Just before I turn the camera on again, some uh, there's like a group, like a family or so, they just got dropped off by totally an Uber. All, all things, an Uber. Monument. Walk over there a little bit. city. Little uh, fountain right there. This is a chain link uh, gate. This is why we can't have nice things. As in, you can't you can't exactly ride up the cobbles when there isn't a race. I guess. I don't know why it's kind of stupid that this this has to exist. Like, not only is it here, it's also it's also right here. Well, you can't really uh, you can't really ride up. 
They don't let you park here either. There's no parking right here. For whatever reason. See everybody slowing down. Let's go right here. In the, in the GM John. He's definitely a tourist, or maybe he is. Or maybe he just feels like going slow, but whatever. So. I guess since uh, we don't really have much time to ride, I guess the next best thing is to, I guess, walk up it. Maybe. That's true, the world will turn here. Well, we're just gonna walk up the Walk up the World Championship and last year's collegiate championship course right here. A little bit of a party going up there. I mean, you don't really you don't really get many cycling races, I guess within city limits, let alone championships in the forms of collegiate last year and worlds this year so you might as well capitalize on that right I'm sure I'll be I'm sure if I uh, if I was gonna be riding up here I'd be going faster than this by a long shot turn here okay if you can't tell I'm wearing flips out like this seems like they turn here then again if you have like a long-standing race like the Philly race where you go up the Mania wall and lemon hill a few laps per race there's probably like semi-permanent paint markings on the like paint markings for cheering specific people and whatnot but I guess since the cycling culture isn't as isn't as established here as in Philly. They don't seem to exist yet. See, even this joint, even this joint's blocked off. Probably because, uh, probably so you don't get people driving their cars in here, which I can understand. But at the same time, you're kind of also blocking the cyclists who just want to ride parts of the course like this part pretty important part nonetheless and then as you make another left up that way back to where I parked my car or my rental car and that's uh that's this part of the course really <laughs> 